Hey, 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 fire signs. Welcome back to my channel, Presence of the Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today's just going to be a love message for my fire signs. So let's get into it, y'all. This is for my Sagittarius, Aries, and my Leos. I'm seeing number love, peace, and blessings. Any other information you need to know is down below. Thank you guys for being down with your girl. So I am giving y'all a love reading, okay? I'm feeling like love is on the way for y'all. And this is what Spirit need me to let y'all know. This is something you've been been praying for because i do have the manifestation card up top the magician somebody could be an aries okay you could be coming into the limelight i'm also here in beyonce we be all night in love we be all night something like that drunk in love drunk in love all right i don't necessarily feel like you're gonna be drunk i feel like it's gonna be a very intoxicating feeling a very euphoric feeling um a nostalgic feeling to be with this person this could be a pisces here you could be um you could have pisces placements it could be in your venus all right you could be having a drink with someone someone may invite you out to a drink this um could be a air sign all right or you have yeah i see drinks somebody may invite you out for a drink yeah the virgo here hermit card I feel like you're coming out of your shell. Somebody wants to help you come out of your shell. I'm also getting be mindful because I feel like there's somebody else who could be trying to put something in your drink when you're not looking. Yeah, that's what's coming up. If you're dealing with a water sign or somebody who is, um, somebody's not emotionally available, they only want a good time, be very careful. Because I'm getting like, there's another person here that you could be like, you don't want, you don't really like like that. It could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Maybe somebody's not your normal type, but they may be good for you. Because this current person or this person, you um, know, I don't know. Somebody could have just gotten out of jail or somebody's like, oh, what is this spirit when it comes to love for my fire signs? The three of wands. Somebody's traveling long distance. The wait is about to be over when it comes to a love situation. The wait is about to be over. You're about to meet your person who is um on the same vibe as you. But I'm not going to lie. Like, there's somebody that is like, they drink a lot or something. Or they always like, somebody could be going to jail for a DUI. Or be careful with drinking and driving. Spirit, what are you trying to tell me? <laughs> what are you trying to tell me? Eternal love is on the way. That's what I'm getting here. Like, yeah, I got the right idea. There is no love. You could be um have like up on all, all night with creative ideas. Are you working on a project or something? You're so busy. Somebody could be in their forties or their fifties, or you want to be growing old with someone. Or you look good for your age. If you're older, you, you like look real good for your age. You look younger. You look 10 years younger. Some of you guys, um, somebody drinks a lot. Somebody's trying to bribe you to drink with them so they can put something in your drink. You need to be careful. If you don't feel comfortable around somebody, stop hanging with that person. Okay, whether this is a lover or a friend, like somebody is too... You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't give a F. It's like, maybe that's all they do every day is just drink, drink. Like, I smell somebody who smell like alcohol, like, very heavily. Like, somebody just drinks a lot. You could have been an alcoholic in the past. Like, you know, maybe. And somebody could be, um, this is a karmic here coming in. Or you dealing with a karmic here. Somebody that only resonates with some the person you was from your past. Don't date somebody that is somebody that's from your past like oh okay so don't date somebody from your past either this is for some of you guys i'm also getting like if somebody is coming in with the energy of like it reminds you of your past maybe this person is not the one because it's like you could have healed from stuff from your past whether they were alcoholic abusive or like they have tendencies of an ex here don't do it it's a karmic it's a karmic. You already learned that lesson. Don't open that door again. Okay. What's next in love? Thank you, spirit. What's next in love? 
yeah, don't re yeah, you're gonna regret it if you date somebody that does not like that's not on the same vibration as you. All right, I'm getting deflection. Somebody likes to deflect a lot. They gaslight. They point their fingers a lot. Yeah, this is a karmic cycle. Be mindful. Don't feel like you have to be on a, put under pressure to be with somebody. Just to, like don't be desperate. Okay, don't be like, oh, okay, well, I can kind of work with this. Even though he acts like somebody from my past, I could probably. Don't think you could change somebody. Don't think that something will change. Somebody is a karmic. Yeah, no strings attached. Especially if this person's like, let's just have fun. This person only wants to have fun, slip stuff in your drink, or they just want to have a good time. If it's not slip stuff in your drink, because that's only for a few of you guys. But it's like, um, they just want to have a good time. Y'all are going to be bumping heads, because that's something that you really don't want to do. It. You really don't want to do. It. Don't do what you really don't want to do. Mm -hmm. I'm also getting, like, there was a, a twin flame here. Um, they decided not to change. They miss you, okay? But they're stubborn. They don't want to change. They could be going through some type of self-reflection right now. Okay, what, what's next here? I guess this is just a warning for you, fire sign, because maybe you're dating somebody that, yeah, man. Okay, your father could be giving you something here. You could have a grandfather that loves you. May the 17th could be significant. Somebody could be a Leo or Saji, okay, or Aries. They all came out here. Somebody could be 19 or when you was 19, or you look very young. You could have a 19-year-old. Some of you guys are older, okay, or... um. You gonna be a good. You gonna look good for your age when you get older. You gonna be a look a good looking milf or dilf. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, something is changing. Somebody wasn't willing to change, so now you're being gifted something. A mature male or mature, or there's this mature male wants to give you a gift. Somebody wants to help you with your business. All right, if you have a business, somebody wants to help you with it. You could be dating somebody that you used to work with or that you're working with. Or you could be dating a boss. Maybe a boss wants to, like, date you. So some of you guys, your, your boss wants to date you. Your, your boss wants to give you money. Or somebody wants to be your sugar daddy or something. Or the universe is your sugar daddy. Or they, the universe, you could be manifesting a sugar daddy or something. Or, or stability or somebody to spoil you. The universe has been spoiling you. And now you, like, you're about to manifest something in the physical where there's a there's a a man or a woman i don't know take it as a resonate who's gonna come in to spoil you because you manifested being spoiled and that's what you're getting it's like the universe always gonna spoil you but they're like bringing someone to do that for you to take care of you i keep getting that for everybody here maybe this is what everybody's manifesting like yeah you're coming out of some type of depression sickness or you could have had went to rehab or you could have healed some type of um addiction here you're moving on here yeah, heaven on the Taurus, angel number 252 could be very significant. Somebody could be 37, 31. The 31st could be very significant. The 2nd, February, the 2nd through the 5th could be significant. Okay, somebody could be 28 or um, spirit gave you a message when you were 28. July the 28th could be significant. Expect a message from your, your ancestors to give you what you need because they know that's what you need. Spirit giving you what you need, all right? The letter C, M, first, middle, last could be significant. Expect a message. What is this? Yeah, of a new beginning. You might want to check out that air sign reading. Um, I think you got to use this one. Yeah, you don't know my name. I'm telling you, somebody new coming in. But, like, somebody from your past or a karmic person with the same energy of people from your past is trying to date you. This could be some type of spiritual lesson. The best I ever had. This new person will be the best you ever had. Sorry, I ain't sorry. Okay. Somebody is coming in unapologetically them. Or you have been unapologetically you. And you're going to get what you've been asking for. Because somebody could have been trying to make it make you feel bad. Like, for wanting somebody to love you and to spoil you. Like, somebody's like, well, you know, that you're a gold digger. <laughs> or something like that. Yeah, you're going to be dangerously in love. We be all night in love. Love. You're gonna have a lot of fun. I'm about to surprise you. Somebody about to surprise you. Somebody's embarrassing, or somebody's embarrassed for how they fumbled you. Or this current person is embarrassed to be in public. Like they're like they're gonna make a fool of themselves being drunk, all right? Or being under the, like an alcoholic or something. Yeah. Yeah, you're an angel. I, that's why I'm getting like this karmic or this um, negative intensity is trying to attach to you because they know that you're you're an angel, you're a vibe. All right, don't feed into it. Don't let this person leech onto you. All right, so let me get some letters out. Okay. 
Jane today. J N. Somebody name could be Jane. Somebody could be from New Jersey. Jennifer could be significant. Somebody last name could be W. First middle last. Somebody could be from Wyoming. All right, Wisconsin. All right. Somebody says all oh, a lot, like all. Oh. Are you gonna be in all with this new person? Root beer could be significant. Somebody could be Geechee. Okay. Somebody could be from the Geechee tribe. Gola Gola Island could be significant. Moo. Somebody could call their grandmother Moo. Somebody's a bum. B U M. Uh, bum. Spirit wants you to know somebody's a bum. Somebody pops gum a lot. All right. You got it out the mud. Okay. Somebody's trying to um, make you feel bad that you want the best life for yourself. BW could be significant. WB. WB Smackdown. WE Smackdown could be significant. Somebody's violent. Somebody has. Somebody is um very egotistical, they're very violent or something, or they have a past life of violent. Some you're gonna get tired of somebody. You're gonna get tired of this water sign or kiss scorpion Pisces or something, or somebody who's an alcoholic because um they don't want nothing for themselves. Somebody says jawing a lot, definitely from New Jersey or New York. Okay. T A Tia Tatas, all right, somebody about your boobs here, you got big boobs. Somebody um size J and boobs could be significant. A J could be significant. Ajane could be significant. Asia could be significant. Tay could be significant. Tawny could be significant. Somebody trying to taunt you. All right. Somebody wants you to let her Y. First, middle, or last could be very significant.